Hello. How are you guys doing? Good. I'm excited to be here. Pretty excited anytime I'm not in my car in traffic these days, right? It's gotten so bad because everyone's on their phone. I mean, I am too, but I use FaceTime. It's much safer. You can have whoever you're talking to watch your blind spot. <laughs> Okay. Like, someone needs to invent an app that sends drivers a text message to let them know that the light turned green. <laughs> they could call it a green alert, because I hate having to wait for someone to honk at me. I, uh... <laughs> I saw something amazing today, though, you guys. I saw a girl taking a selfie while she was driving. Like, not at a stoplight, while the car was moving, right? <laughs> And normally I hate selfies, but that is a great selfie. I feel like it's good for natural selection. Uh, hashtag Darwinism. It's okay, anyone that would do that wouldn't get that joke. Um, so bad though, I have to have my phone with me all the time. It's like a security blanket or I panic. Like I just had a landline installed in my apartment so that I can find my cell phone. Because <laughs> I lose it like every 15 minutes. <laughs> Siri's like my best friend. That's the person I talk to most. Do you ever wonder why they made it Siri and not Simon? Right? Like why is it a girl and not a guy? Uh, and this is why I think, because if it was Simon, you'd be like, hey Simon, what's the weather like outside? And he'd be like, huh? <laughs> you'd be like, hey Simon, dial my mother. No. <laughs> hey Simon, could you give me directions to the Laugh Factory? Yeah, I know how to get there. Did you put it in Google Maps? No, just keep going straight. This looks familiar. <laughs> hey, Simon, do I look fat in these pants? The weather outside is 97 degrees. <laughs> so you're saying it's too hot out for pants? Is that like a passive way of saying I do look fat in these pants? <laughs> Dialing your mother. Do I look fat in these pants? He's like, why don't you ask Alexa? I'm like, who's Alexa? Are you talking to someone else? Hey Simon, are you talking to someone else? Hey Simon. <laughs> and he goes and never talks to you again. Blocks you on social media. <laughs> I get competitive. Us girls are competitive, right, ladies? Or, okay, a couple of you are honest and me. Um, but at the end of the day, we gotta stick together. I'm on a girl power kick. Where, where are my ladies at? Uh, really into women's rights. Like, I just think as a woman, it's super important that I fight for my right to stay at home and not work. You know? Like, also, my right to work just only if I feel like it. Um, and I think equal pay is super important, but, like, if I'm honest, I do kind of feel like certain jobs can be better suited for one sex or the other, right? At least generally speaking, because these are the things that I think about at night, right? Like, okay, if I'm trapped in my fifth floor apartment and the building's on fire and I see that the firefighter coming up the ladder to save me is a chick, <laughs> be disappointed. <laughs> like, I'm huge. What's she gonna do? Keep me company? Like, hold my hand while we both burn to death? Maybe sing Kumbaya? Like, there's a reason I started this fire, okay? <laughs> I thought, show me the hell of it come up, right? Like, in his little magic mic, get up. <laughs> and carry me to safety, or no, like, strip, and then give me a lap dance and carry me to safety. <laughs> Like a firefighter should do. <laughs> I, um, I also don't think us girls make great navigators. Yeah, no one ever disagrees with that. <laughs> All right, like I don't know much about history, so I typed into Google famous female navigator or explorer. You know the top hit that comes back? Amelia Earhart. <laughs> <laughs> She's still lost. <laughs> Be like, what about Dora? Um, 
but who's even seen her lately, right? I think she got deported. No, actually, I'm wrong. She's probably in one of those like prison camps, separated from her parents, scared shitless. I'm just saying. Can you imagine what would happen if you separated Trump from Ivanka? <laughs> Mm -hmm. He'd be fine with the other kids going. <laughs> There's jobs I don't think men should do, though, right? Like, pretty much anything that requires listening. See the men didn't laugh because they're not listening. Thank you guys so much. Man.